there is a price for speaking up. And there could be a price for remaining silent. At times, remaining silent will be the heavier price. And not necessarily will you be the person that will pay it. It could be someone else. With my travels throughout two continents, I've had many ups and downs. And I think I've, I've had enough downs for me to say, fuck, man, how, man, how fucking, how fucking lucky I am. How lucky are most of us who live in the Western, um, in, in the Western world? Right now, I could just say, you know what, fuck it, man. I'm gonna go um, to the uh, two dollar matinee, three dollar matinee to watch old movies in the theater. Um, I'll go to the fucking beach. Go fucking drinking, get high, especially here in Los Angeles. I could go just go fuck around, be amused, and let go and relax and whatever the fuck, right? Enjoy the fucking weather. I believe. I think I'm not sure that uh, it was Confucius said something like uh, some words like uh, do not laugh if your neighbor has uh, has a funeral something like that And I thought, uh, you know, how many of us have ever been in a bad mood, gone through some sort of tragedy, and someone starts cracking up a joke, and our dumbasses sometimes will think, oh, is he laughing at me? Is she laughing at me? Are they laughing at us? And not to be a whole fucking uh, sourpuss and say, uh, oh my god, you know, don't enjoy life, don't do this, don't do that, no. Appreciate what I have. I'm, I am reminding myself to appreciate what I got. That can be effective in uh, many ways. Um, and with my audience here, my I think I'm at 418 subscribers. I got a couple thousand. Friends, followers on Facebook. I can uh, share my mind on share my thoughts on uh, things that uh, get my attention or distract me. Because as I, as I watch uh, the talks by Dr. Uh, Jordan Peterson, and he has to fucking waste time to, to talk about gender pronouns. Not just him or her anymore, it's sh uh, shim and she or some shit like that because some motherfucker gets triggered. Some motherfucker doesn't know if they're a boy or a girl. And it's harassment, it's hate speech if you don't identify them in their sort of shit. I think, I think this is sort of giving me, um, motherfuckers like that isn't giving me 
are giving me uh, an easier time for me to address people as, hey, what's up, motherfucker? Because it's not, I'm not addressing you as him or her, it's simply as an adjective. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I'm not uh, sharing, sharing technique, right? I'm not focusing, I'm not elaborating on my drawing technique or by using the stumps to uh, blend in the lighter tones, the grays, so that they don't um, smear into the lighter areas. I believe I used the 20% uh, uh, gray pencil, gray prism pencil, and I'm brushing outwards towards the dark areas so that the light areas don't get smeared in. And in theory, I could uh, just speak about that, but some of you guys could have uh, more challenges than me or less challenges than me. my train of thought here because I'm thinking about the angle how to shade here um and with the gen all this shit talking about gender pronouns, the shit talk, well, the events in Manchester and London recently, a few days by followers of the death cult known as Islam. And those who have been following my older work, especially on Facebook, you guys know that I've been banned uh, five or six times already. I've just been, be I've just been uh, behaving and like a zombie since but since I got off my last ban. Yeah, but that doesn't solve shit because look at all the dead people in London. You know the motherfuckers that I was critiquing with just the drawing they're sympathizers. Gave these pieces of shit more um, freedom and willpower to keep on doing their fucking nonsense. And I've got a handful of people that I really, really, really care about, and uh, I know that uh, you know, all relationships eventually end, but I'm gonna try to um, keep these relationships alive for as long as possible for all, all of us to remain healthy and in communication and help one another. But man, what a what a tragedy it would be if I um, were to lose some of these people because of fucking Muslim slime. You know, what if you lost the people, someone you love because of Muslim slime? Someone said, no, you can't critique uh, Islam like that, you know? So what if they beheaded your granny? So what? You know, it's their, uh, their um, free freedom of speech. And there are motherfuckers that will tell you that, you know, it's the, um, who are you to be judging their, their religious beliefs? And Yeah, that's us, man, the uh, human species right there. So uh, throughout my uh, channel, throughout my videos, I will be talking shit. Am I talking shit or am I, I think I'm pointing out shit of uh, the toxicity, the death cult, the uh, walking, suicide bombing cancer of civilization.
gender pronouns. Do you think I give a fuck if you're a, a boy or a girl? Some dude or some chick, some motherfucker or some bitch that's watching, subscribing, thumbsing up, thumbsing, thumbsing up. Is that one? Thumbs, give me a thumbs up, give me a thumbs down on my shit. Uh, do what you like, um, but if you ever give me a thumbs down, I, I request um, an explanation. Where am I wrong? Um, how could I have said something better? Did I say something false? Um, I think communication is uh, it's important, man. You know, we've uh, evolved beyond the uh, our days of... Uh, you know, living with uh, patches of uh, dead fur on our bodies as clothing and you know, being extremely superstitious. No, not having the ability to go to the supermarket, but instead uh, having to go hunt um, the days at dinner. the internet you know it's a the internet say let me see if this is correct a timeless time capsule eventually I believe uh, so much information will be cataloged uh, effectively that we can simply just look up keywords and get uh, as much information from certain type of people from a certain time, a certain area learning certain things and you know, I think uh, ignorance will be and uh, will, be, will be a choice or will be a uh, trick a trick for whatever government or corporation that wants you to remain stupid out of touch of reality, harmless to um, their agenda. And now I sound like a conspiracy brother, but our future, especially if you have kids, our future could be marvelous, man. Marvelous. But uh, at times we make decisions because of being so fucking pussified that uh, that's politically incorrect. That's going to hurt someone's feelings. <laughs> that's going to offend someone. And um, we fucking, what that does, it rapes truth fucking throat kicks just <laughs> justice corrupts justice